Okay, Mr. Tregobov, um, congratulations with your uh, shared victory in, uh, in the Paris Championship. Thank you very much. Um, actually, you were leading the tournament for a long time. Uh, what happened in the in this tournament? Could you describe your tournament a little bit? Well, I was very tired in the last half of the tournament, so I played really badly, and so it's, I was a lot of luck to, to share first place finally. <laughs> okay, because you started with five wins, I think. Yes, well, the first part of the tournament, well, I, I did quite well. I'm quite satisfied with my result and with the, even with the quality on the gates. So, but well, beginning from the round six it was uh, a disaster for me. I played well. It, well, I was really tired. I was really tired. Well, okay, four draws isn't is decent, I think. Uh, well, I was completely lost in a couple of games. So. All right. Yeah. All right, and. Um, I, actually, you're the president of the Association of Chess Professionals. Um, how do you combine this with chess, by the way, like with playing chess? <laughs> it's very difficult. <laughs> yeah, it's very difficult. Well, now, nowadays I play uh, less than before because uh, this sort of activity takes all my time, actually, and, uh, and well, my results are, are not improving <laughs> since I became president. When was this? This association. Two years already. Well, okay, actually, I was working for the ACP for, uh, and even before. And uh, well, it started four, four years ago already. So, okay, even, even at the beginning, it was, it was quite difficult. And okay. now it's getting more and more difficult. So, okay. Yes. But, okay, I'll see. Some, it, it's nice to know that I, I'm still able to, to, to win the tournament. So. Yes, it's good. Actually, the chess world seems to be more difficult, more complicated uh, all the time. So maybe this chess uh, association of chess professionals, uh, yeah, has some uh, some interesting uh, uh, tasks. What, what do you think uh, are your main goals for the near future with the association? Oh, uh, well, it's still the same to protect the players' rights. Uh, all, 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 all type of. Uh, Situations with our dialogue. Well, we're, we're trying to develop our dialogue with FIDE, which is quite it's crucially important. Uh, and uh, besides, uh, we'll try to develop our ACP tour, the tournament circuit created by the ACP. We managed to organize our first uh, ACP World Rapid Cup last year, this year, in the beginning of this year, and uh, we'll continue. Uh, looking for uh, other sponsors to develop the circuit. Maybe uh, our next uh, aim will be to, to create the super circuit for, for the best players of the season. Well, I mean, instead of one single tournament, to have some series of tournament in the end of the season. Uh, but okay, we should work hard to. to, to to get there, so yes, yes. the matter of future. And um, since I, I haven't seen uh, yet uh, an official statement by the ACP on the new uh, FIDE cycle, can you uh, explain a little bit how you, what is your opinion of uh, the new cycle with uh, Mexico and then uh, the match with Toplov and France? Oh, well, okay, the whole system seems to be quite uh, logical. But uh, the problem is that uh, Mr. Tobolov has got a lot of uh, advantages uh, according to this solution. I mean, okay, it was clear that it was not fair for him to, to push him out of the whole circuit, but uh, uh, the current solution is, uh, well, because the current decision doesn't seem fair to, to other top players because he is not even uh, top rated anymore. So the result, for example, why uh, uh, Topolov should get more privileges than Man, for example, I don't know. Yes. It seems, seems a little bit strange. And um, yes, that's true that the ACP did not get, and did not issue any uh, official statement on this matter yet. So we're waiting for, uh, 
place, top place opinions on this matter, and then we'll we'll see what what. You're, at the moment, you're speaking with uh, with players, uh, and in we sent a, le a letter asking for their opinions. All right, so we're okay. waiting for their replies. All right, and uh, could you share maybe uh, some opinions already, or? Uh, uh, not, For example, not, do, not do, really, not really. I play, do uh, you know uh, maybe the general opinion of the of the players who will be going to Mexico? How, how they be, uh, no, that's why uh, that's mo mostly the players of Mexico. Yes. Uh, to whom we send our letter. All right. And uh, we are waiting for their reply. So if you, if uh, well, I, I shared some opinion, but if they are not official, I would like to, to talk about it. Let's wait for okay. the, for the official statements of the players. Okay. It's, it's crucially important on this station. Yes. Another uh, new development is uh, actually the new company uh, called Global Chess. They have uh, big plans. They will be organizing uh, Grand, uh, Grand Prix tournaments. And uh, these sound a little bit, little bit like the tournaments you're uh, doing and planning to do with ACP. So is there already some contact between ACP and, and Global Chess? And, and to what extent are these plans similar? Uh, there is a current uh, technical, let's say, contact with the uh, global chess, but uh, not on this matter yet. Not yet. I, I don't. I'm looking for the possibility to see uh, uh, these guys, but uh, uh, maybe uh, I will see them this summer, and we will have the possibility to discuss uh, the matter. But uh, up to the moment, I, I don't have any idea what uh, this uh, Grand Prix system should be. Mm -hmm. So uh, I cannot say anything. Yes, but uh, in principle, it should be something like basic tour. I mean, the whole idea of some tournaments with the final stage. Yes, and then of course we have the World Cup cycle by FIDE, and uh, at some point all these cycles have to converge, I guess, uh, to get the strongest player and finally uh, uh, players who will play for a world championship. Um, what do you think actually uh, should this result in a, in a tournament or in a match for the World Championship? Well, actually, I, I can give you my own opinion, but it's not me and even not the players who decide on this matter normally. Because uh, uh, the crucial point is what is better covered by the media, the match or, or the tournament? I don't know the answer. So if the sponsors know, so they. It's up to them to choose, actually. Mm -hmm. My own opinion but that uh, the tournament is okay for me. All right. But the whole uh, tradition of chess is in favor of the match. So, yes. And uh, a lot of top players support the match. Kramnik, Leko, Aranen, in his recent interview, said that he's, uh, he's for matches. So, okay. All right. Be, uh, okay, thank you very much. You're welcome.